hey what is up guys and welcome back to my channel i know i've been gone away for a little while but i am back so in today's video we are going to be reviewing this wig that got sent to me from bgm girl hair and listen guys this company sent me over their 26 inch water wave lace frontal wig and i don't know i just love long curly wigs who's with me on that one cap construction of this wig as you just saw has four cones plus adjustable straps at the back and if you are wondering why the laser was cut, I cut it before I started recording this video. And I did that because I wanted this install to be very quick and easy and I also didn't want this video to be too, too long. Also, I bleached this hair off camera and as you saw just then, I put my foundation on top to make sure that it will give me that ultimate melt. So the glue that I'm using in today's video is the Chic Bond glue. I used it in my other video i think two videos ago for a different wig install and i'm still loving this glue i still think this is the best wig glue by far and i don't know about y'all but this wig glue is a defo must have for me so yeah i'm just waiting for the glue to dry clear and once it does dry clear then i'm gonna go in and apply the lace and for today's hairstyle, I thought of curly hair, then Cardi B came into my mind, so I was like, why don't I recreate the Cardi B curly wet look what hairstyle? And another thing guys, if you want to get that ultimate melt, make sure you use your rectal comb and press in that lace directly into that glue. Trust me on this, just make sure you press your rectal directly onto that lace and push it right into that glue so that the lace does not lift. So yeah, you just see me there drinking my cushion from KFC just so um, that glue can dry clear. So I'm just wasting time, dancing, drinking away, waiting for this glue to dry clear. And then once it is clear, just like before, press the lace right into the glue and press it down with your rectal comb. Another thing that I like to do to make sure that my wig is extra secure, I like to go in with my got to be freeze blast spray and spray that onto the lace. And then I'm gonna get my headbands and wrap this lace down. And I leave the headbands on for about 10 to 20 minutes max. Alright guys, so whilst that is setting, I'm going to go spritz this hair so you guys can see the actual full texture of this unit. I don't know if it's me guys, yeah, but I just find it so satisfying when you spritz curly hair and then you just see the definition of the curls coming to life. Like, I don't know, but I just find it so satisfying guys. So this is the hair dry versus wet. So as you just saw, once the hair is fully dry, it gets very, very big. And once it hits water now, the curls just pop. Okay, so once I remove the bands, I'm gonna go in with my wipe and wipe away any of the leftover glue residue that doesn't need to be there. Then I'm gonna go in and pluck a little bit of the hairline and do I would say minimal kind of slash dramatic baby hair but I think it's minimal I don't think it's too too dramatic and now once that is all set and done that is literally it guys so you'll see the end results in just a sec So yeah guys that is it for today's video if you enjoyed watching today's video please leave a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below let me know your thoughts or if you have any questions and i'll get back to you and just so you know as a reminder this hair is from bgm girl hair 
and this is in the length 26 inches and in a texture waterway so i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys